Hi, I'm Brianna Motzkus. And I'm Tracy Cole. And today is Tracy Tuesday. <laughs> Right. So while mom is uh, cruising the sunshine in the Gulf, um, we will see her tomorrow though. Mom and I figured out how to be all techie and such. So we'll see, hear from her tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yes. Oh, cool. Yeah. Great. So yeah, super excited about that. Nice. Um, but while she's away, Tracy has been working really hard on remnant rolls and scrap bags. So it is again all linked below. Or if you go to our website, fabricpatch.net, um, click shop online, scroll all the way to the bottom, you'll see fabric, patterns, books, blah, blah, blah. Keep all the way going and you'll see a scrap bags and remnant roll. Click that and there's everything that we're going to see today, anything that's left and anything that slowly may probably pop up. So to save you sending us an email or save you time making us a phone call, um, if you are looking for remnant rolls or scrap bags, check there first. If there is nothing there, that means everything we have shown or have talked about is currently sold out. Um, I do want to warn you, it does happen fast, so I'm not sure when so you're seeing this. Fast. So congratulations or... <laughs> So sorry. Yeah. Don't uh, even waste a second trying to email or call or anything. Just we don't want to have to disappoint you. Go to the homepage, <laughs> scroll to the bottom, find remnant scrap bags, and shop. And fast. there you go. Put it yeah. in your cart. Buy it. Yes. So, so which and one do you want to start with? Oh, I'm um, sorry. We can go. we can shuffle it. Okay. I mean, I don't know. I don't know it's gonna be easier for them. I think they're just gonna be in mayhem anyways. <laughs> um. So remnant rolls. Um, and we can get it however it works. Remnant rolls. Remnant rolls. This is number 540. So this one's just a big beige cream ensemble. This one is probably your biggest print. It looks like it's an old French general piece with some leaves on it. And when you go to our website, you might be able to see it closer. Um, up, there's a better picture. If you're thinking, ooh, that's really pretty, but I can't really see the prints. Check it out online. Um, five, is that 550? Yeah, 550 is a beautiful Christmas. You've got a little Andover Christmas Village, reds, ornaments, love it. 551, a little bit of soul shine and dance in Paris, beautiful. So a little bit of gold metallic in 551. 541, I love this color. so bright, and everything coordinates, so you could really totally make a quilt out of this. And the remnant rolls, you have about, what, five yards? In the remnant rules, five yards yeah. at least. At least. Yeah. So whether there's a lot or a little, um, you're going to get at least five yards of whatever's in that mix. Yeah. So there's some really. Five fifty two. If you uh, need to spend a Valentine gift card. Yeah. A nice little pink for next purple. Year. Yeah. Oh, well, you know, speaking of that, yesterday yeah. was my birthday. Yeah. I've been thinking about. I need new sunglasses. Oh yes. So I've been trying some new things. <laughs> I don't know. What do you think? Oh, I love those! They're kind of like Elton John, Elton John. <laughs> but I don't sing. So no. maybe these are for Barbara because she I, could sing. Oh, she yeah. would totally get those. So nice. I'll share these with Barbara. Those are but, cute. You know, rose-colored glasses are great, but they kind of mess up with your mess with the color. Oh, right, so the tint let's of everything. Go this way. Um, five, um, forty-two and five forty-three. They are the same. So this is a really cute um, nursery rhyme one. So you've got. Um, Characters, uh, numbers, and alphabet, and little red um, rhymes in here. Really Again, I don't cute. know if you guys can see that one, but it's super cute. Super cute. Very cute. Um, five hundred. Uh, Those colors green, are just fun. Teal. Mm, just love like that. that other one, really. Yeah, really fun. I like these two. Five hundred one. <laughs> Oh, well, I think it's really planet, pretty. Our planet, oh, yeah. a lot. Well, at least what, those th one, three, two, three of them. Yeah, that was really, really pretty. Really pretty. Line. Blacks, burgundy, gold rust. Mm. Good stuff. Love it. Those are kind of. These are kind of the same. Kind these are of. They might have a little. That five, has a little different. Forty-five. Similar but different. <laughs> five forty-six. So my brother's birthday card said to me. Similar the same but different. different. <laughs> 544. Again, um, five yards in your remnant rolls. Super nice. cool. 547. I love, love, love this. Teals 548. Blue. This is so pretty. Really pretty. This has Ooh. seven different pieces. Kelly Ray Roberts. Yeah. Dance in Paris. Dance in Paris. A little bit of gold and metallic. I don't know what this guy is. Gold here. metallic. That is so cute. I think that was like from the heart or from home. Oh. This is really pretty. 548. That's pretty. Ooh, 549. 
stuff. So this is some bits see. left over of, um, is it Carolina Lily? Carolina? Yes, yes, yeah. Carolina Lily. These two for, two sure. for sure. So this is a big, huge, That's pretty fun. Lily. Oh, love it all. Did I show this one? No, I love it. Look at all the textures in there. I love that stripe. Me too. Oh, so love it. Pretty. I'd love to see what people do with them. Create, you know, I do they know. just use part of it for another project? Or, or are they, they making it into? out of what they get in the bag. 554 blues. 555. I love A that. little bit of um, Effie wood. Yes. So it goes from like, to me, like this... Um, Soft little key yes. point, and then on up to it's the a little harder. Bold, bold forest. Of, love it. Love that too. Yeah, because these are hand. Did I show five forty-seven? I might have this one already. I'm not sure. I don't know. I had a lot of blues. But these are fun. These are really just a hand. Tracy like just plays too. them all together. Um, I think it was five thirty-eight. Grays, a little bit of black. Five thirty-nine, gray and cream. So much fun. Five fifty-six, blue and white. A little bit of silver metallic in those two. Love it. All right, just a few more scrap bags. Five fifty-seven. Super cool. Almost like fiesta wear. Yeah. Go oh on. yeah. Yeah. Very summer in Mexico. Yeah. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> Five fifty-eight. Some background. This looks like it's a linen canvas. A um, little bit of gold metallic That's in there. That's the calm after the party. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> um, 559. That's really That's pretty. Beige and blue. Classic. Love it. Yeah, so All awesome. right. Okay. Those are remnant rolls. On to the scrap bags. Up bags. They are so much fun. So, and the scrap so bags, there's a lot in the scrap bags. I don't know if there's and a... Is there there's a, no way to really measure yes. the yardage because there's yeah. so many pieces. There might be she some pretty much big pieces or a few little pieces, but yeah. I try to put the colors. She tries to fill the bag. Yeah. So it's still a good deal. That's um, beautiful. The number 100. Very pastel berry. Um, three sisters. If you like the pastels. Lovely. 101. Um, if you guys watched my Toothless Twofer um, YouTube video, this looks like it might have been remnants and scraps from my when I made the quilt. So bright, primary, pure colors. So good yellow, it's orange, really, blues. It has a lot of different scraps, and it's really earthy. Yeah, there's a lot Some in there. Big, yeah. 102. And you've got different textures, too. It looks like you've got some wovens in there, some flannels. Some yeah. cottons. It's really pretty. And it's nice, I think, with the photographs that you post, that it gives okay. you a little bit of better idea yeah. of what's Yeah, and the pictures getting. she takes, they're all spread out. So she takes the big picture of them all spread out, and then she packages them so she can ship them to you. Um, 109 looks Christmassy. Very traditional Christmas. Blue, yes. uh, reds and greens. A little bit of gold in there. Okay, good stuff. 103... Um, chocolate and red, very elegant. Did I saw 103. Mm, mm -hmm. Pretty. And these are like pretty big pieces, really. I mean, there might be a yeah, few that one bits has in a there, few but big ones. that's good. Yeah, these are nice, kind of 105. Fun stuff to play with. Okay. Yeah, those are really pretty. Black, white, and everything in there is pretty much goes with your white, red, and white. Yeah. It's mask making. 106 is a whole bag of mask making stuff in it. So there's the um, Oli Fun, which is the, um, not really, it kind of works with the filter. It creates that little bit of a barrier. Has some patterns in there. Um, a bunch of elastic, strapping, buttonhole elastic, shoelaces, um, whatever options you want to do for ties. And there's also some other um, interfacing options. So again, this has to do with how mom and I shared with you guys how to do masks. So when we talked about the stabilizers we like, the elastics we like, the other products, this is all the products that we like and we used. So, and including all of the pattern sizes. So that's pretty cool. 106. Yeah. I like that one too. 107. Pretty. And you even got some little itty bitty remnants. And the remnant rolls... No, they're not too bad because these are... They're a little um, bigger? Well, they're... Because like the remnant rolls, I think there's nothing so less than a yard in here, right? Right, nothing less than a yard. And if yeah. there are small remnant rolls, they're going to be at least really? a half a yard. Yeah. At least a half a yard. So these are so, some smaller ones. See, these are a little smaller, you know. So a 17-inch piece, a 3-inch strip. Just some weird bits that we found. But yeah, really cute. Really fun. 
That's just a, a lot of 108. Lots of really bright stuff in here. Some cave stuff. I'm not sure what that is. That's cool though. Some really bright. Some, some little packages of kits that you guys put together <laughs> or, or little random, random bits. Pieces. Yeah. So those oh, are kind cool. of fun little extras. Yeah, there's in there. some really fun bright ones in 108. I don't know. I really want something about these colors this year. That really citron green and aqua. It's 110. Really cool. That one's gonna go fast. Pants like that when I was yeah <laughs> in grade school. <laughs> Harper nice. would rock those pants. Yes, she would. Right. Christmas. One eleven. Yeah, Christmassy. So you got those icy blue. So if you want to make a winter quilt, there's a lot of just winter colors in here. You've got a few that are kind of Christmas oriented, but the rest of them are just pretty. Yeah. Really nice. One twelve. Aqua and blue. There you it's go. It's a thing. It's a thing. There's some really cool textures in here. Some really nice lights, some really dark darks. Really pretty, really good blues. 113. Lots of nice pretty creams and beiges. And again, you got some texture. You have some wovens in there. You've got a linen in there. Some solids, some small prints. Really pretty. These are fun. <laughs> pom poms. 114. Colors. Really nice, bright, fun colors. And you get some little added fringe in there. Just because it always like makes that. it fun. Just, I don't know, is that a certain line? I can't remember, but I really, Oh that's yeah, cool. this is um, a, just an out of print Tula. Um, oh, that's what I thought. Bumblebee, Tumble, oh, I have it. I love, I love it. it. Cool. So yeah, a little bit of a green one. Oh, yeah. here's a good one. 115, Batiks. Mostly okay. jewel tones. A love few brights, the love it. My the peak one, the Batik ones are the ones that go the the go the first. Best. First to go. Yeah. Here we go. Um, 104. You've got this really pretty floral um, panel in there. These are probably like six inch um, flowers. You've got a pretty decent sized panel in there, it looks like. Mm -hmm. And you've got a bunch of different um, coordinating pieces. So you've got some bright, some solids in there, and there's bright things to complement your panel piece. Which really cool. flowers that there are. Here we go. 116. You've got mint and rose gold in there. Um, what else you got? We've got some pretty things in there. Some mint green. This is a really pretty linen with a white. You probably can't even see it at all. With a pretty little white print on the top of it. Really nice. 118. Blacks and grays and go into that kind of those rich browns. Really pretty. And look, there's really pretty fun things in there. I like little yeah. tiny. I like those bits, yeah. those strips and things. Oh, Brianna, no, you Cute. can't have it. Ah. <laughs> I heard you have a lot of fabric. I do. No. I do. But I, and I have a lot of scraps, too. Under, I need to get my sewing room clean so I can do you guys a tour of my sewing room. When you walk in, that's the first thing you see is under my cabinet I have these, um, I don't know if they were shoe drawers or what they were, but okay. they're all labeled and all of my anything smaller than like a fat quarter. And some fat quarters, I guess. If I can't put it with the rest of my fabric, it goes in my bins. Um, and they're all color coordinated. They're pretty fun. My pink is overflowing, of course. Um, <laughs> is my that Harper's favorite color, pink? It is at the moment. It is. It well, Wyatt is purple at the moment. Cool. His change is purple pretty often. His, his change is pretty often. Nice. Um, it's like his marker of the week. But <laughs> it's pretty fun. Uh, 117, very good, bright primary, fun kid stuff in there. Really cute. Really Some cool. solids are in there. I love that one. Good colors and bright. But 119 cool. is a really good just fall bundle. You've got really nice rich fall colors. Some nice oranges. Some browns. Ooh, 120. Somebody loves purple. 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 120. Lots and lots of purples. Love it. Looks like it's, again, pretty decent sized pieces in this one. And mm -hmm. some smaller pieces maybe in there, but... Beautiful. Yeah, sometimes you get um, like these nice already cut triangles or squares, and I, mean, I haven't used anything like that. But I, I, I kind of think, ooh, it's might so help nice inspire to have it somebody. Cut. One twenty one. Like this looks like it's all flannel. So you've got some bright greens. You've got some really rich um, hunter greens in there. Looks like that's a piece of the design wall grid, the one we use, the little flannel back with the two inch grid on it. We've got a kit of something in there. I don't know what that, or maybe that's white. Know. I don't know what's it's, in it. I can't remember. But it's all flannel. Cool. Cool, cool. I think this one's kind of fun. It has a 
Ooh, tiger it has a tiger in it. One twenty-three. Or a lion. Brown. I mean, it's a lion. The lion, little lion panel. Mm -hmm. Something's happening in there. And I don't know if it's a full panel or a piece of a panel or um, some of the panels that make it into scrap it was bags. In one of the little, yeah. Yeah, the ones that make it into scrap bags are usually ones that um, maybe it was cut a little weird, so like half the panel is good. Um, it was cut crooked from the manufacturer, so you can save a block, but you're not going to have that two-inch bit that borders the fabric. So scrap bag panels have a little bit of an error to them, but not an unusable error. You could still cut it up and do something special with it, so that's pretty cool. Even just the part that shows I right now, that. just showing the nose Let's, and the eye, I think that's it pretty gives cool. it kind of a cool yeah. strength that's to it, pretty. like you can build off that for sure. 122 is another flannel one. Nice, bright kid stuff. Looks like there's... No, that's flannel. Yeah, there might be a hidden there. piece of minky yeah, in there. I think that is Oh, minky. yeah, the purple one is minky. Yeah. So, yeah, nice, fun, didn't bright. Have a lot of flannel this time, so it was yeah. kind of a mix-up of what lovely For pieces. colors. Yeah. 126, another purple. This is more of those dustier purples. So you got some dusty purple, some eggplant purple, and you've got a few cave purple pieces in there okay. for some fun little zingy pieces. More. 124, the sunshine. Yes. So some cave pieces again, some really pretty rich fall colors. Um, this one has a really pretty, um, this is another panel that's in here that has really pretty butterflies in it, kind of line drawn butterflies. That'd be really pretty. pretty. 125 is pastel and florals, and you've got a whole bunch of two and a half inch squares. That little bag says two and a half inch floral okay. squares. Really cool. And that was 125. I think we're at and the end, but I have yes. to share this because yes, I just should. love this. Sabrina so that go back works here, she made this, and it is uh, it is a Kelly Ray Roberts um, line, which you know I love, but isn't this adorable? Maybe if I put it up on the table, you can see. Oh. So cute. But you know, we have patterns like this, right? That they have the crisscross. Yes, and I will I'll link it in the below for you. I think it's Chris called crisscross um, apron. What's really nice about those aprons, it takes all the stress off your neck. So if you oh. um, feel like, oh I can't use aprons because it really hurts my neck, this puts zero stress on there. Which how it's should so I hold it for cute. you? Isn't it cute? That's perfect. And then she I put all the these trim. little extra fun charms on here and these little tabs, which I think remind me of Lederhosen, <laughs> and with and uh, some more charms down here. I think you could almost get your scissors on that little yes. charm. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. And and she makes three it out pockets. of kind of a um, cotton denim is what she uses. So, okay. Um, that's because really you nice. can use it as a gardening apron. I it'll, love it. It'll dual purpose. I might just wear it every day with a t-shirt and shorts all summer long. All right, so. All right, so I hope you um, got something, hopefully, maybe. Yeah. Um, if not, check back. We'll try to do Tracy Tuesdays if we miss it. Occasionally, if we run out of space to store things, mm -hmm. we'll just put special ones all of a sudden in there for those of you that... Wow. check back. Mm -hmm. um, also, since we're doing scrap bags of remnant rolls, don't forget to check clearance fabric. So oh. since mom's been away, um, I don't have to be, um, she doesn't have to see my clearance pile and weed through it. So <laughs> how, how we clean together is she'll start her clearance pile and I'll start mine. And then we look at the two of them thinking, oh no, I have a perfect place for this piece. Or, oh, this is just too pretty, putting this one back or whatever. So we apparently, we weed through our own clearance pile so we can keep more out there. So it's unweeded. It is just good stuff that I need space for. What so is that, uh, uncensored. Yeah, <laughs> uncensored. Yeah. <laughs> so check that because um, Saturday we did a lot of cleaning. I even got Robert to move a shelf for me. Um, we were all very surprised. He said yes to that, but he was also <laughs> home alone with the kids. So you know, um, what's worse? So um, lots of that, and that's what we'll be doing. We did yesterday. It looks we'll do so today. good. Yeah. Oh so my lots gosh. of cleaning. So not lots of new things will keep popping up in there. So it's beautiful. All right. Have a great rest of your day. Yeah. We'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you tomorrow morning. Okay. Um, we have a special guest for our Wednesday box opening. Yes. Super excited. And then um, we probably won't see you again until Sunday afternoon for our Sunday box opening. All right. All right. Bye. Bye. <laughs>
Thank you for watching our video. We invite you to leave a comment, hit the like button, or better yet, subscribe to our channel so you never miss an episode. You can also visit our Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, or Pinterest pages, or find all of those things and our online store at fabricpatch.net. Can't stop me now You can't stop me now.